Hello, I'm going to give a brief overview of the new DrivePrint Google Cloud Print connectivity. What this means is that Drive will push its targets and queues and printers up to Google Cloud Print so that users from, Drive, from uh, Chrome or from Chromebooks are able to print to the printer directly from Chrome without loading a local driver and in a way that it records who printed it and then it goes into the right queue. So the first thing that you're going to want to do when setting this up is uh, add in settings your Google Cloud Print user ID and password. This should be a Google service account or a user that is able to share out printers to uh, other users in the Google Apps domain. Remember that this is mainly just for Google Apps. If you have like a personal Gmail account, this won't work. It's just for Google Apps users, um, which should be pretty common. So you want to enter your username and password there and save it. And then here in the printers and queues, if you go to the hold queue or you find a printer, there should be a option there for Google Cloud Printer. So you're going to want to enable that. And then in Manage Server, at the bottom, there's a Google Cloud Print service, which you're going to want to enable. What that's going to do is broadcast that Google or that MyQ up to Google Cloud Print, up to the Google API as a target. And if I look here, you can just go to google.com uh, forward slash cloud print and log in. And here I'll see all my printers. And so here there's that MyQ uh, that's being broadcast up from the Drive server. Um, and here I could share that out with other users on the Google Apps domain. Here I'll show you an example if I'm in Google Docs. Um, and you'll see here that I'm actually on my server, but this would behave the same actually if you were on a, a Chromebook. Um, Chromebook obviously is just a little laptop with only Google Chrome on it, which means that you can't print from a logical printer as we normally would. So here what I'm going to do is I want to print this document. Um, when I select a target there, you see local destinations that won't exist on a Chromebook. Um, you'll just have Google Cloud Print printers. So if I pick that MyQ, I can change the copies. I can say I want it in black and white, change the pages. Um, and when I print that, it's going to send it directly down to the Drive server uh, as me. And so any user that's logged in, they can print to that MyQ as long as it's been shared to them. And you'll see here in Drive, if I go to Hell Jobs, um, there's my job right there. And the reason why we know that it's the user B. Hill is because in users, you see that that's the Google account, and that account or that email address is assigned to this user. So typically, you would sync with LDAP or sync with AD, and the user's name uh, would be their Google login, which is typically how it's set up in Google Apps. So again, uh, very simple. This connector allows you to print from Chromebooks or Google Chrome directly to drive print without the need for a local printer or a print driver. Uh, and it also allows us to track those prints and to put the prints into the right user's